Welcome back everybody, I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. And today's beer review is from Shorts Brewing Michigan to Ann. This is a 8.8% ABV and 80 IBUs. Right up your alley. Okay, I this just want to taste This is a Imperial slash double IPA. <laughs> I said up my alley. Never, I think I've liked, what, two IPAs in my whole entire life? Yeah. But cherry might be... That might be all right. So, as Jessica said, this is a double India Pale Ale brewed with Michigan cherries, malt, and hops. It's shorts. Yep. I'll try it. So, I would say cherry color head on their dark tan, you know, cherry. I would say it has a reddish tint. Okay. Okay, let's go with that. Small bubbles. Yep. Finger of head. Cloudy. Yep. Cannot see through it. Um, I would almost say a light cherry color. Light cherry strawberry color. I would say it's a strawberry color. Yeah. Again, yeah. Okay. Smell. Oh my. God. <laughs> Citrus. I feel like you hate me when you make <laughs> me do me. Trying to take one for the team. I saw cherries on there, so I was like, oh, this could be okay. I'm getting, like, citrus, malt, fruitiness in there. I'm getting a whole bunch of it. smells terrible. How do you people drink this shit? <laughs> yeah, I, I would say citrus, malt, and fruitiness. Sewer. <laughs> okay, taste? No. <laughs> Oh, I will do it just because it's shorts. One, two, three. It's not bad. It's not bad. That's weird. That is too... That is... It's tart. Yeah, it's, it's like It's things that shouldn't be back. together. Things that it's shouldn't like be together. Malt. Some citrus... I have goosebumps. Alcohol and cherry. I am going to... You should not ever put cherries in an IPA. Right? Yeah. Like, don't ruin cherries. That is it's, awful. It, <laughs> I can't. Um, I like want to scratch my tongue with something else. It's, it's not even, it's, I, it would be totally different if it was just an IPA, a double IPA, if, you know, whatever. But the cherries yeah. just make it so. It's like, oh man, I'm trying to think. Oh man. It, it's like the malt goes through the beginning and then it gets to like a cherry tartness alcohol is and then the cherry tartness alcohol like lingers yeah my tongue tastes yeah. awful like there's nothing immediately up front like in an ipa you might get you know whatever some fruitiness citrus up front okay. it's like it skips the front malt all the way to the back then like sour tart cherry and to me i alcohol. think it smells kind of like Kind of, I wouldn't say rotten, because that's not a good, that's not a proper It way. was uh, bottled on 6-15-2017. So it's, it's fresh. Yeah. It's, it's just. It's not even, I'm trying to think of, I don't want to even say fermented, but it's not, it's not a sweet cherry taste. No. And I, but I, in my head, you just can't put cherries in an IPA. It's not, I don't think anything would ever come up good out of that. If someone has a good cherry IPA, send them my way, I'll try it. <laughs> but it's, it's, this, yeah, this it's, is, it, oh, To me, shorts. it's way too malt heavy. Okay. In the middle. And that tartness, sourness, cherry alcohol is not good. You know what I want? I want shorts to... To tell us why they did this. I want the people at Shorts to... to I, I don't... Because I would never, ever, ever put a cherry 
a fruit well, with, a, with see... an IPA like that. But you know what? They're a grapefruit IPAs. That's nasty, too. So It's, it's obviously too dry. Yeah. Maybe that's why I'm like, yeah. Eh. So it's it's all the <clears> things <throat> I don't like. But, you know, yeah. we should just, the people at Shorts should invite us up. Because I, would, I, I love some shorts. Right. I would give this a two out of five. Okay. Am I supposed to judge it? No. <laughs> You've complained enough. <laughs> I don't, I wouldn't ever, I, I don't, I would love to, to know what people, if people love it. And why. Well, they're on untapped. <clears throat> There's been 2,500 reviews. Okay. And the average score is 3.72. So people aren't like, this is delicious. Right. But maybe it's the IPA lovers that are like, mm, it's different. And three of my friends have rated it a 3.33. Something to say about your friends. Tyler. Give me. Mostly Michigan beer reviews. Give me a soft Mike. parade and I'll shut up. But this, not delicious yeah not delicious i'm very sorry but tyler this... gave it a 2.25 at there you go tyler you're right that's right it's right it's, it's gross yeah but we try it right because we love our shorts mike gave it a 4.25 we i don't know him <laughs> i don't know mike but if i knew mike i would ask him why so mike why why did Holy you think cherries. it was okay um eh, it's, <laughs> yeah yeah so you know you yeah. win some you lose some we love right. we, we really like love the shorts ones or we don't right there's eh, no it's okay cool. it's all right we tried it so that'll wrap up this beer review until next time i'm brad i'm jessica happy brewing thank you for watching this video thumbs up if you liked it thumbs down if you didn't leave me a comment down below to tell me what you thought about this video also don't forget to subscribe and share and hit that bell so you know when new videos are coming out. You can check out these videos over here. Also head over to 31stbrewing.com for everything beer and home brewing related.